Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Selling with Corey where we do these sit down to chat videos. You follow me on my print on demand journey. Give me advice on what to do to help myself out as we see in real time how this is working out for me and I really hope this helps somebody in the future. So today we are doing a weekly update plus we're going to talk about my plans for February and we're gonna do merch by Amazon. I did my Etsy shop one earlier in the week, so if you haven't already, go check that out. But today we are going to focus solely on merch by Amazon. So let's talk about January. At the time of recording this video, I have had zero sales for January for merch by Amazon. Obviously, there's still a couple of days left, so I could be surprised and I could make some last minute sales for January. Um, but as of right now, we have a big old goose egg on mine and my husband's Merch by Amazon account. So not really much movement going on. Um, my husband's account, I did a lot of the niches that he kind of designed. Um, so I was hoping those would get a little bit of attention. I'm not sure if it's my keywords or if it's the designs themselves, but unfortunately none of his has sold and neither have mine. I did notice the other day that some of my designs that I have have apparently been up since the beginning of December. So instead of my standard swapping them out every month, those have been up for almost two months now. Not a big deal. They're just gonna be the first ones I kind of swap out in February. Um, so my plan in February is to obviously go in and slowly swap out those designs. I'm probably gonna do about one or two designs a week. Um, just because there are some designs in there that I've been working on that are going to happen kind of middle to end of February. So I want to give them a little bit longer to kind of do their thing, to kind of make sales. So we'll see how that works out. I'm just going to save those for last and then swap out the other ones first. So that's kind of my plan at this point. Don't know if you all notice, maybe it's something new, maybe it's showing Merch by Amazon is kind of noticing my designs. I haven't seen anything about it. There was nothing in the messages for Merch by Amazon. Uh, there's no updates I heard about, but apparently I can now upload two designs a day. Not, yeah, I can do two uploads a day. Threw myself off there for a second. So I can still only have 10 designs because I'm still only tier 10 on both of our accounts. But oddly on both of our accounts, it went from only one upload a day to now I can do two a day. Um, so because I haven't started swapping out those designs, I've just been putting them obviously on different products instead um, because I'm going to wait until exactly February 1st before I start going in and swapping out those designs I have. So I found that kind of interesting. I'm not sure if that's like an everybody thing or if it's a prelude to tearing up. Well, let me know in the comments down below what your thoughts are, if you've seen it too, if maybe there's an update I missed. If I missed the update, please leave me a link to it so I can check it out because I got no email about it, no update, no nothing. Um, so I'm not sure maybe it went into my junk mail, my spam mail and my email, or maybe I'm just missing it. Not sure what's going on there. Um, so obviously I plan on swapping out designs come February and I'm really hoping the fact that I started a social media account for my Etsy shop that maybe people will start go looking up those designs on Amazon um, because some of those designs I do plan on uploading to Merch by Amazon. Uh, just kind of get more exposure out there. So we'll see what happens. I have been working on more designs that has more graphics on them, which obviously means I'm putting a lot more work into them because um, I'm still designing everything myself. So we'll see if that makes any kind of difference because um, I know I was told a couple videos back to not do so many text designs that sometimes they tear you up based on your graphic designs as well. Um, so that's going to be in the works. It's going to be a plan on what I plan on doing. So I've already started working on that. I've already started working on new designs and things that might kind of help out with that. Um, so we'll kind of see how that goes. Uh, also something interesting, my husband got an email because he sold more than $10. Uh, last year for 2021 for Merch by Amazon, we have to file that on taxes. Um, now my Merch by Amazon, if you've watched my six month video that I did one or two weeks ago on like my finances of how everything worked out for the six months, um, my Merch by Amazon, I believe only made a little over $7, but he made a little over $10 in US and then a little over $10 in European dollars in royalties. 
And apparently if you do $10 or more, you have to file it at tax time. So that's going to be interesting to see. If we pay any taxes on it, I doubt obviously it's going to be a lot because total it was only about $21, give or take. Um, so I really don't foresee us having to pay a lot at tax time, but we'll kind of see how that rolls out and see what happens with that. Just kind of something I thought was very fascinating to see. Um, so we'll see how that works. And if I can get some clear cut information on that, maybe I'll include it at some point after we do our tax time. We'll wait and see. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much all I've got going on. Uh, just doing our rinse and repeat when it comes to everything. Upload, give it a month, see how it does, swap them out. Um, maybe I should be waiting every two months. Uh, give me your recommendations down below. Uh, I know the ones that I put up in December, I'm definitely swapping those out come February. Um, but give me your recommendations down below. Should I be swapping them out every month or should I be swapping them out every two months and kind of give them eight weeks to do their thing and kind of see what happens. Obviously, I accept any advice you have to give on this situation. Hit that subscribe button if you want to follow me on this journey and see how everything goes with my Etsy shop and or my merch by Amazon. Give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and I'll see you all next time. Bye.